coming off a wing and trying to run with Selwood right now as Blitzars won the tap. Might get a secondary bounce here. It's 10. It's a big stat for him. Sock it out of there by Dahlhouse and Tui got rid of his opposite. Hasn't kicked a goal this year because he's so often part of that back six. But Zach Tui with a great chance, a thumping kick. Brisbane missed a couple from here in that second term. And Cluggage just took the weight off it. Oh, Berry, no free kick there. Oh, oh, is there an um, no, no umpire's paying a free kick. Everyone expected it. I think the players now they'll it. get one. Zorko all over Kelly. Old school captains made the decision there. There was a free kick. Zorko plays on. Oh, Stewart over the top of everyone with a spectacular spoil. But Brisbane a chance at ground level. A little fumble by Hipwood. Did the Lions no favours. Dangerfield with a show of strength. And O'Connor tumbling his way. Kick. Let's have a look here. Oh, oh that's he's solid. Got, he's got every right to ask the yeah. Now, that's... You can't get a better angle if you... Here from Duncan's handball keeps it locked in for Brisbane. McCarthy trying to get there. Henderson playing it well. That handball missed the hand, though, and Bailey will get the free kick. Here, just straight drop punt here. As we can see, great vision here. Plenty of space between the two sticks from this angle. And he's been a good luck charm so far in 2019. Zach Bailey, 10-1 and one record for him. Off the turnover, he's got options inside forward 50. And the cluggage is one of those. And they've both been you know, changing. Where tends to be the go-to. The fans are packed in at the Gabba, ready to rise. McCluggage, oh, the post again, that's been hit a few times. Advantage as well, Handsworth goes to the pocket. Up goes Charlie, and he'll get the free kick for being tunnelled. Had quite a few shots today, Charlie Cameron. Can he nurse this one home? He can. And the Gabba has been waiting for a goal like that. They get the first. Charlie Cameron's always looked dangerous, doesn't he? Look at the replay here. And seriously, jeez, umpire's got a much better angle than we do, but get on the motorbike, Al. What was your celebration? You have the motorbike going? <laughs> yeah, Kelly picks it up. Oh, Spears one to Hawkins on the lead. One-on-one -on -one forward of the ball, Tui and Hodge. Here come the runners. Cameron trying to go with Guthrie, a test for his hamstring. Charlie Cameron as Guthrie kicks a beauty for Geelong. They got out the back that time, and they kicked their first in this quarter. 25 metre pass if you're going to miss miss out in front of your teammate and didn't need to use Tui who was running back in the goal square and out with that hamstring Neil goes long to a two on one contest created though now Brisbane go to work at ground level Cameron under pressure great pressure by Geelong oh now two on one Brisbane climbed in the square and that's deliberate they say what's the umpire say that's okay such a good kick as well Here's what it's happened. A danger field injury. Been just in the way up. More knee. Oh, Rayner climbed again. The fists of Geelong able to rush it through the milestone man. Good handball as well. Right out in front of Rayner, who goes long. Cameron puts a body on his man. Charlie has them right where he wants them. Big goal for the Brisbane Lions. Approaching three quarter time. Next day to get that mark, but get onto his feet quickly to get the ball into a dangerous situation. One on ones over the back, and Charlie Cameron in any matchup is going to have an incredible advantage at ground level. Poor old Lockie Henderson knew that uh, he was in all sorts of strife, made him go straight back to the fence, not allowed to come around on the angle. And he said that affects his normal run up, so see how he fares. Good looking strike off the boot from Hawkins. Another poster, Clint. He kicks towards Radigalia and cut. Oh, Dangerfield! Couldn't quite complete the mark. Gardner back out there with that shoulder a little sore. Tumbles it back to Hawkins, who chips it and missed his man, Dahlhouse. Here comes McStay helping out down back. Coughs it up to Tui. Can he kick his first goal of the year? Not on this occasion either. McInerney in front. Now it's all Geelong keeping their feet. And a couple of guns combine, make it a third. Dangerfield. And Andrews, the goalkeeper, got there. The Blitzars uncontested in the end, goes to Radicalia. Got a hop, skip, and a jump away from Harris Andrews, finally. Born in Griffiths, New South Wales. A deliberate approach. The big man for his second goal of the afternoon, and that is a beautiful kick.
from Radigalit. Towards the goal square and calling for the ball. Pointed towards the boundary line. And that, as you said, Ruzi, that's an outstanding kick because it's weighted to the advantage of the big forward and just didn't, it wasn't elevated high enough so Harris Andrews could actually get there and spoil. Austin Dangerfield has taken over lately. Oh, Mark not taken, but on the follow-up, danger to finish it all off. Not quite. They're going to have to start picking up the tempo of the ball movement. Snatched out of the air, and they get an entry here. Nudged his man under the ball. Cameron from number four. He's into the top five in the Coleman race. And Brisbane... Trying to launch that comeback through their star up four. Look at this. This is Hughes versus Cameron. Not one other Geelong player has, has gone back to help his teammate. Which S means that, that Buse has to take a bit more of an aggressive position. If there's a teammate there, then Buse can play back back shoulder. And that ball, look at that kick. It's a great piece, he's, done, it? he's done most things right there. Yeah. As Jed Buse, but just had to keep the ball in front. I think that lady on the veranda is going to go viral the way she watched that kick. She was saying, oh, yeah. McInerney went up as well. Selwood stayed down. He's got a free man out the back. How's the bounce for Tui? From the boundary line, the Irishman trying to put a bit of work on it. Gardner did rush that through, trying to execute the kick. It's a minor score. It's got to come back for the kicking. Brisbane, off-hands Lions had a runner on the outside again. Kicking to the pocket for Cameron. Henderson got back to create the two-on-one off-hands. We're about to go back past the midpoint of this final turn. Brisbane will have to change that game plan soon. Here's Dangerfield. Tries to wait it. Parfit, no free kick. Hawkins! All the way through. That's a goal from about 75 outs. And notably, I think part of the reason why, why Tom Hawkins was shepherding the ball across the line is just out of the middle of the ground. Bit of power. Goes towards... Maybe, no, no free kick there, but this is where Hawks start to tighten up here. It was a hamstring or calf, but very tight. It was smart play in the end from Hawkins, wasn't it? Yep. You see here, typically that's a free kick that's paid, but you see here, I reckon he's a chance to go, and then no, I'll let it go. Hand ball wide. Tui, new role for him today, playing forward. Goes to a one-on-one. -on -one. Hawkins! Oh, he left it behind, and Adams... Ground balls it through under pressure. We've got some handy users on the outside. Zorko and then Neil and that bouncing through from Lyons. <laughs> Entry inside 50. She with it and got every piece of that slapped around the corner by Cameron. Blitz arms. And Geelong working it clear, but a hand in there. McInerney, clever handball. Lyons gets one and they're back within two goals again. Great kick in, wasn't it? That was deep. I think Blixarves keeps the ball in play, flicks it flicks between his legs. It's an aggressive play. Yeah, Lockie Henderson just... Great tackle by Charlie Cameron. Put the pressure on. Between those two. They've been going at it all day, and Cameron just checking on Pew's welfare there as Robinson steams through. Found a teammate. McCarthy almost threw it out. Umpire said play on for Ablett. Gardner read it best. Wants it to go out in the full, but it landed just inside. <laughs> oh! He's called deliberate. deliberate. He's kicked a 60 metre tall. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Can he squeeze the kick in? He can. Plenty going on between Buse and Cameron again. Lyons turns his man inside out. Got the kick away. Cameron! Oh. Oh. <laughs> Buse again had done everything right. Last time they beat Geelong, they came back from 52 points down. The comeback today is not so big. Oh, oh, Cameron misses a great opportunity to make it less than one straight kick. And Lyons gives Hipwood one to chase. Sits for him nicely. Great tackle. Harry Taylor oh. turning back the years. Great stuff, Harry Taylor. McCluggage, he spun his way clear so many times. Henderson in the middle of a couple of Lions. Handball is on here. Oh. Cameron won't miss this one. And it's back within one straight kick. Three and a half minutes to go. It's the top of the ladder blockbuster we'd all hope for. Quick ball movement down to a pretty much a two-on-two situation. Ball stays in from the spoil. And Charlie Cameron just got away from that contest. His second effort, his ability and want to stay involved with the contest. That was the difference there. In the hands of Rich on his wrong side. Had to go banana with the left. Dangerfield back as the spare. It sits for him eventually. Handball. 
They intended to get a rush behind out of it. They can afford to do that, Geelong. Fumbles it back towards Witherden. Another entry. Oh, the big ride! McCarthy in game number 50 against his former team. What a mark! Well, you think back to the miracle on grass. It was the milestone game, McGrath with the winner after the siren in game 200. Now game number 50, and it's all been worth the ride for Lincoln McCarthy. But they wanted to move the ball fast, and there, Link McCarthy, we saw at the other end of the ground in the first half of the season, took a massive catch and goal. And that one was probably more important. Huge grab against his old club. Got the hands on the shoulders, everything. It's, oh. just, it's just the fact. Umpire says that was a free kick against McCarthy. Crowd not happy. Danger been a star. Takes the game on. Runs away. Goes long. The big men are there. Andrews with the spoil. Oh, Radicalia for another one. Not quite. One behind. I and mean, not to lose today. Goes wide. Berry v Duncan. Up they go. Andrews got there late. Hodge tried to pluck it. Geelong with numbers. Atkins. Oh, he ran into a team tackle. And look who's there again. McCarthy helping the team against Geelong. And a nine-game winning streak. Kelly nearly held on to. He threw it out Dangerfield. Play on for Ablett. Radicalia trying to set up a teammate with it. And anywhere will do. Bouncing ball. It was touched off the boot. McStay in game number 100 to McCluggage. And they're going to win at Brisbane. Final seconds ticking down. The Gabba is about to go off. You better start believing in Brisbane. They're top of the ladder with a round to go. A remarkable win against the Cats, who led by 18 points on multiple occasions. Look at these celebrations.